Man's quest for communication is as old as mankind. Be it the testing times of war, blazing guns, proud advance of troops, or blissful sunrise of peace, in industrial or professional walk of life, one thing remains vital, and that is communication. Communication and info technology are two important facets of today's increasingly interconnected and interdependent fields for sustainable development via innovative education. MCS, the prime institution of Pakistan Army's Corps of Signals, has been contributing to the fields of telecommunication, information technology, electronic warfare, software engineering, and information security for over seven decades. This center of excellence is imparting signals training to the spirited men of Pak Army and technical education to the youth, the future of Pakistan and the world. Since its inception in 1947 as the School of Signals, the institution has stepped up various milestones such as distinct affiliation with the Royal British School of Signals in 1960 and becoming an affiliate of the University of Engineering and Technology Lahore in 1977. In 1991, MCS became the first college under the academic emblem of National University of Sciences and Technology, NUST, for quality education up to doctorate level and got a new identity as the College of Telecommunication Engineering. Military College of Signals functions under Signals Directorate at GHQ. The college is commanded by seasoned and professional army officers in the rank of Major General or at times at Brigadier level from Corps of Signals with a challenging diversity of command over a reasonable blend of army officers, soldiers, NUST employees and civilians from Ministry of Defense. Starting from the first commandant of Military College of Signals, the college has seen 37 commandants all of whom envision making MCS a center of excellence for Pak Army in communication and respective military disciplines. The college functions with seamless integration of admin wing, training wing, engineering wing, combat wing, cadets wing, and a research and development wing. I consider myself very lucky and honored to have this historical and distinguished academic institution. Military College of Signals provides five engineering degree programs under the engineering wing and 22 combat signals courses under the combat wing, which enroll more than 2,500 students per annum. Grooming and nurturing of military cadets as potential officers for the Corps of Signals by Cadets Wing during their degree course in another immodest facet of MCS. It's the engineering wing that manages all undergraduate and postgraduate degree programs. The college has a balanced blend of civil and military faculty with 32 PhD and 33 MS qualified teachers on roll, adding more than 300 students annually to the alumni of the college. Achieving excellence and professional competency in military training remains the core focus of MCS. The training routes from basic and mid-level signals combat training for officers to advanced leadership and foremen of signals training with simulated battlefield exercises and war games. MCS offers its training programs to over 850 students from 39 friendly countries. Currently, each year, more than 100 officers from allied countries are trained 
at Military College of Signals. I am Captain Saranga. I am from Sri Lanka Army. My name is Major Makki from Saudi Arabia, Port of Dar. I am Captain Ali Bin Tahir from Bangladesh Army. I am undergoing a course uh, under the combating of Military College of Signals. Research forms the basis of modern education and MCS uses its focus on R&D to align academia and students in line with the new vistas of knowledge. A mega event, Open House, is organized at MCS every year to showcase the final year projects of young engineers. Indigenous development of unattended ground surveillance system, UGS, provides the testimony. I'm Hendra Abbas and I'm associated with the Department of Information Security Military College of Signals since November 2010. My name is Brigadier Imran Rashid and I'm working as Head of Department Electrical Engineering since four years. The MCS has a serene campus right in the heart of Rawalpindi. Spread over more than 50 acres, MCS houses purpose-built infrastructure divided into administration and training areas. Grown to nine academic blocks for both military and civil students. 30 classrooms equipped with modern training aids such as smart boards facilitate both teaching and learning. The college has 47 dedicated research labs, four syndicate rooms, communication skills lab with modern day equipment affluent students in foreign languages. The college is self-sufficient with state-of-the-art multi-purpose hall, four ambient and modern lecture halls. MCS conducts seminars and workshops on a regular basis. In this regard, an international level conference on emerging technologies in the field of telecommunication and software engineering is held biannually. MCS Library houses more than 40,000 volumes of professional, academic, and general books. Activities of historical importance are digitally archived by MediaCell at MCS Library. Separate cafeteria for male and female students provide the much-needed relaxed and refreshing time. For social and professional interactions, Signalians Alumni Association was created in 2003. It connects over 2,500 members inland and abroad. At a short walk away, we see three purpose-built hostels, buildings separating male and female students. A well-maintained sports area with tennis court, football and hockey ground. Basketball court and squash courts provide for evening games. While retaining its focus on academic infrastructure, MCS makes environment preservation as its area of attention. Grandiose, spaciousness, grassy lawns, beautiful gardens and pathways add to the natural feel of the campus. With gender diversity and equal opportunity options for military and civil students, local candidates and international friends, the college continues to serve the nation with pride, honor and commitment to quality education.